What have you learned about what cities can do to drive innovation that creates jobs? First off, the truth, we just have to do it for starters. I mean, we have to support innovation. We have to start thinking differently about how we address job training, uh, job recruitment, job placement, um, growing small businesses, growing small local startups in our, in our hometowns. Growing talent, you can just do in your own base with your own students, you know, in high schools, middle schools, making sure they're getting trained if they're going to go to college or what are they going to do after college, are they going to go to some kind of a secondary school locally. But making sure that you're preparing the best talent for your community. Most people who grow up in an area are going to stay in that area. So being able to start with that base is a great place to start. The next place would be attracting new talent and actually bringing people into your community. That now, in this day and age, means an international world. You might be bringing in someone from Venezuela, somebody from Bolivia, who's incredibly talented in the industry that you're looking for. But why are they going to come to that town? You have to start addressing that. You have to start making sure that you're providing the kind of culture and the kind of uh, uh, climate in that community that people want to be in that city. So it's a little bit of thinking about it in a holistic nature and taking a holistic approach. Growing that talent from the young people who are in school, making sure that you're looking long, long range, you know, what kind of jobs, what kind of industries you want to grow in your region. Some regions have different types of industry, it's just a natural fit. So then you also want to look at how do you recruit new companies to come to that region. And then of course the companies that you have that are growing there on their own. You start supporting more talent, they're going to start supporting more business, and they're going to start building these small local enterprises that are going to grow, help them grow, help them innovate and, and, and get connected with the rest of that global economy, and then they'll be successful.